hello guys welcome to another video in this video we are going to learn about the stock scion relationship a grafted or budded plant can produce unusual growth patterns which may be different from what would have occurred if each component part of a um, graft grafted rootstock and scion was grown separately or when it is grafted or budded in uh, other types of rootstocks there are some relationship between the root, uh, rootstock and scion uh, such as uh, effect of stocks on scion stocks on scion cultivars such as size and growth habit um, uh, precocity in flowering and fruiting uh, fruit set and yield fruit size and quality nutrient status of scion winter hardiness disease resistance ability to resist uh, soil adverse conditions um, in this video we're going to learn uh, briefly about this um, relationship so let's get started size and uh, growth habit in apple rootstocks can be classified as dwarf semi dwarf vigorous and very vigorous rootstocks based on their effect on a scion cultivator cultivar uh, in if a scion is grafted on dwarf rootstocks, uh, the scion uh, grows less vigorously and remains dwarf only. On the other hand, if the same scion is grafted on a very vigorous rootstock, the scion grows very vigorously. In citrus, uh, trifoliate orange is considered to be the most dwarfing rootstock for grape and sweet oranges. On the other hand, uh, in mango, all plants of a given variety are known to have the same characteristics, canopy shape of variety, despite the rootstocks being of uh, seedling origin. Then next step is precocity in flowering and fruiting. The time taken from planting to fruiting uh, precocity is influenced by rootstocks. Generally, fruit precocity is associated with uh, dwarfing rootstocks and uh, slowness to fruiting with vigorous rootstocks. Uh, mandarin, when grafted on citrus jambri rootstocks, is pre uh, precocious than those grafted on sweet orange or orange or acid lime rootstocks. Then, fruit set and yield. The rootstocks directly influence on the production of flower and setting fruits in oriental parsimon. When it is grafted on uh, lotus, it produces more flowers but only few mature into fruits. However, when kaki is uh, keki, keki is used as rootstock, the uh, fruit set is very high. The influence of rootstock on the yield performance of cultivar has been well documented in many fruit crops. Acid limes budded on rough lemon registers nearly 70% increased yield than those budded on prior site range Rongpur lime or its own rootstock. Then next one is fruit size and quality. The physiological disorder granulation in sweet orange is very low of if on uh, Coleoptera mandarin, Cleoptera, Cleoptera mandarin uh, seedlings on the other hand, rough lemon seedling stocks induced maximum granulation. The physiological disorder black in violet pear did not appear if Pyrus communis was used as the rootstock. When Pyrus uh, pyrifolia was used as the rootstock, this disorder appeared affecting food quality. The next one is nutrient status of scion. Rootstocks do influence the nutrient status of scion also. Uh, Sathu Gudi orange um, trees have a better. Uh, a nutrient status of all nutrients in the leaves when it is budded on Cleoptera mandarin root stocks than on its own root stock. Then next one is winter hardiness. Young grapefruit trees on wrongful lime would stand winter injury better than on rough lemon or sore orange. Uh, sweet oranges and mandarins um, on uh, trifoliate stocks were more cold hardy. Then uh, disease resistance. In citrus, considerably variability exists among the rootstocks in their response to diseases and nematodes. For instance, rough lemon rootstock is uh, tolerant to uh, uh, trichotillomania, xyloporosis, and uh, exocortis. But 
uh, is susceptible to uh, gamosis and nematode on the other hand atoyer site range is tolerant to gamosis but susceptible to x cortis virus disease similarly guava varieties grafted on chinese guava resist to wilt disease and nematodes the next last one is ability to resist soil adverse conditions among the citrus root stocks foliate uh, orange exhibits poor ability while sweet oranges uh, so orange rangpur lime root stocks exhibit moderate ability to resist excess salts in the soil similarly in palm fruits uh, variation exist among root stocks to resist excess soil moisture or excess boron in the soil the effect of scion on root stocks uh, root stocks such as uh, vigor of the root stock uh, cold hardiness of the root stock and uh, precocity in flowering vigor of the root stocks in apple it has been found that if apple seedlings were budded with the red uh, astrakhan apple the root stock produced a very fibrous root system with few tap roots on the other hand if scion uh, golden bark was budded on the seedlings they uh, produced two or three uh, ponged deep roots without a fibrous root system in citrus if the scion cultivar is less vigorous than the root stock the rate of uh, growth and the ultimate size of the tree is more determined by the scion rather than the root stocks then cold hardiness of the root stock cold hardiness of citrus roots is affected by the scion cultivar so orange seedlings budded to eureka suffered much more from winter injury than the unbudded seedlings then uh, precocity in in uh, flowering young mango root stock uh, seedlings 6 months to 1 year old were found to put forth in fluorescence when the branches from old trees are uh, enarched enarched with which can be attributed to the influence of scion on the rootstock so uh, these are the um, uh, uh, rootstock and scion relationship that's all for today see you in the next video thanks for watching